Hello everybody, this is Mike Dietrich speaking and today I would like to show you a quick command line upgrade to Oracle Database 18.3.0 on-premises. As we have completed the pre-upgrade steps, the first thing is I set my environment here for 11.204 because in the 11.204 environment in my Oracle Home DBS directory there is still the SP file and also the Inidora I generated during the pre-upgrade steps. So let's have a quick look into the Inidora and check if the parameters I changed are really settled there. So the recommendation was to set SGA target to 1 gig, that is done, and processes to 300, that is there as well. Just a hint on the side, compatible stays on 11.204, so we could potentially do a downgrade later on. I will copy now the SP file, which has the same parameters, to the new Oracle Home 18 DBS directory, and I will do the same thing with the init aura I showed you a second ago, just in case if I have to edit something, makes life easier. Now I switch to my 18 environment, so UPGR database, but now with Oracle Home 18. So just let me switch to the Oracle Home 18, and I have this shortcut, so OH18 is just the same thing as Oracle Home here, just less typing. So the files are there, what I miss is the password file. So I create now a new password file with ORA PBD, a file ORA PW, UPGR, password, and of course you can do this interactively, so you don't have to write it on the screen, but I show you my very secret password and the format is 12. So file is there, password file created. Now I can start the database. So I open SQL plus and start up the database in upgrade mode. That may take a few seconds because shared memory segment has to be allocated and such. And when the database is up in upgrade mode, I can exit SQL plus. I will change to my RDBMS admin directory. And now I will invoke the command line upgrade with cutctlpl for parallel slaves, which would be the default, a log file, and saying cut upgrade.sql. And as you don't want to wait now for quite a while, I do a fast forward. So you see the face is now passing through quite quickly. It starts off with several serial faces and at some point parallel faces come in. So you see here we're going fast forward. Some faces took a bit longer, uh, some faces are faster. And in many faces we can upgrade many things at the same time. So you see parallel faces, serial faces where just one script after another gets executed and restart. Restart means we kick off the background processes for the next step. They never take longer than a second. So you can safely ignore them. So the upgrade progresses. And at some point we reach the components. And as most of the components are serial upgrades, such as Java in this case here, uh, you won't see many parallel faces. XDB is parallel partially, uh, but others are not. And the upgrade completes at some point. So altogether on my slow VBox, this took 30 minutes. And I hope you enjoyed that. So thanks a lot for your attention and have a great day. Bye bye.